Hey everyone, Tankenstein here. If you guys didn't know, the new event cycle is active in War Thunder, and we just got our first news on what the next vehicle is going to be offered. It's going to be the PLC 83130 in the Inferno Cannon event. That's right, we are going to be getting a rank 5 tank destroyer for the Chinese ground tech tree in this event, and the event will be running from April 24th at 11 GMT all the way to May 8th at 11 GMT. Now, this is pretty much going to be a small smaller gunned version of the PLZ-83 that we currently have in game. So instead of a 152mm howitzer, which is again what we currently have in game, we will have a 130mm Type 90, or 59 rather, one cannon which will be a much higher velocity cannon compared to what we have at least currently with the 152 millimeter howitzer now i've been trying to do some research here as to what sort of ammunition this can carry and it almost kind of seems like it will only be able to carry he so i'm not entirely sure if it's going to have apds apfsds heat fs none of that but it will likely just be able to carry he but still a very very potent weapon especially with the higher velocity that this thing is going to have and doubly so only at rank 5. Now as you guys may know the previous events have been really really high scoring events you'll need 45,000 score for each round in order to progress but this time you only and I use only with air quotes need 35,000 score which is pretty damn decent so 35,000 score every two days basically in order to get a task star which by the way you can purchase your task stars if you don't complete the score requirement and basically the stages will change every two days on the 26th 28th 30th 2nd 4th and 6th and this is available only on stage 7 so not only is it going to be fewer mission points but if I'm not mistaken, there's fewer stages too, which is really, really nice. And you can also get these really nice add-ons as well, including the Born to Hunt decal, Missile Man patch decal, and of course the anti-tank rocket launcher Chinese decoration. So actually this is a pretty cool event in my opinion, because not only is it going to take a bit less for you to be able to grind for this, but you also get some really, really cool secondary doodads as well. And you even get a random camouflage for a vehicle you own, premium count, all that sort of stuff. So pretty damn cool if you ask me. Now, if you want to be able to trade this thing on the marketplace, you will need to get a total of 600,000 mission score between the start of the event and the end of the event, which is May 8th. So it will take quite a bit for you to be able to list this on the marketplace. Time will tell exactly how good this vehicle will actually end up being. Not entirely sure. Again, I think this is going to be an HE based vehicle. Correct me in the comments below if I am wrong in anyway in that regard but either way this is uh pretty pretty good news in my opinion i'm pretty excited about this obviously i think the object 292 which is the first event vehicle from this new event cycle is likely going to be a bit better at least relative to br and rank compared to this however i think that this is going to be a ton of fun as he based tank destroyers and war thunder have been amazingly fun at least in my opinion so i said thanks so much for watching if you don't mind please consider liking commenting subscribing but either way thanks again i'll see you all on the other side take care everyone